And there you have it. We upgraded your profile and gave you options on how to create content for LinkedIn. LinkedIn is the professional network that many people overlook. It's a platform that quietly changed the way we find jobs, share successes, and build long-lasting relationships. But there's a problem. As a user, you're a part of a huge crowd of people competing for attention on a platform where it's challenging to stand out. So what's the solution? You guessed it. ChatGPT. With the tips and tricks I'm going to give you today, you can use ChatGPT as your LinkedIn assistant that will change the way you use the platform forever. Imagine being able to create high quality, personalized articles and a profile that stands out from the rest of the crowd. In this video, you'll learn how to do just that. And look, I'm no power user of LinkedIn myself, but luckily I had Sally help me out with the script. She's a researcher that looked into all the ways that ChatGPT could help us here. And Sally luckily has a lifetime of experience when it comes to the job market concretely in the US. So shout out to Sally and my research team for some of the tips that I'm about to give you on how to use LinkedIn to get the most out of your career. So first of all, we'll be looking at how to craft a professional headline with ChatGPT. This is probably the most important part of your profile as it summarizes in one line what you're all about. And we've been testing this content on various other profiles, but today we'll be improving my very own profile that I don't use much, but I would like it to be as good as possible just because you never know who might need your help in the future. So let's get to work. So we'll start working this with this prompt formula. What are the main keywords on LinkedIn for a job title in the specific industry? So I will just go ahead and customize this for myself. So I'll say YouTube in the generative artificial intelligence niche. We're just going to use vanilla GPT-4 here, but now that did add Bing, so you could analyze some websites for keywords, but we're just gonna go with this because the results are actually exactly what I'm looking for here. And the reason we start with these keywords is because a lot of the prompts that follow here will use these keywords. And honestly, these recommendations are great, but they're a little too specific for my niche because with AI, we're already so niche down to the wider world. All of these words don't mean much. They just know about artificial intelligence. So I'm just going to keep it simple and stick with artificial intelligence as my main keyword here. And the reason is because I'm trying to appeal to a wider audience than people that watch this channel, right? I want to craft my LinkedIn profile so anybody could understand what I'm up to these days. Next up, we're going to use one of three formulas to craft your headline, okay? So one of them would be job title at company and keywords. In my case, the company is AI Advantage. The job title would be YouTuber and my keywords would be artificial intelligence. I'm going to put this at the beginning just because it makes more sense. And there you go. This would be a powerful headline, which I'm going to use much better already, right? But as your situation might differ, here's two more formulas that you can apply to craft a compelling headline. One would be stating your value proposition plus your specialty. An example of that would be a data-driven marketing strategist and then the specialty is boosting ROI for B2B companies. As the word implies, the specialty should be quite focused because now you'll show up in searches that are looking to improve their ROI for B2B companies. Another formula would be achievements plus keywords. So the example here would be award-winning sales executive, revenue growth expert, healthcare industry. And here you can just add multiple keywords that you identified that make sense for what you're trying to do. And now what you can do if your result with the keywords are more relevant to you is run this follow-up prompt. Based on the following formula and information above, write a LinkedIn headline using the top keywords, no more than 120 characters. But there you go, it's gonna follow the formula and give you some suggestions. And as you know, you could always follow up with three more. And actually some of these generative models, content generation, AI ethics, do cover a lot of the things that I talk about. So this is actually surprisingly good. What about AI content creator at AI Advantage, generative artificial intelligence, AI research, media production. You know what, this is actually so good that I'm gonna update my headline here and actually looking at this, I will remove AI research. As for most people, that would mean I work inside of some research lab or publish papers. But really what I do is just overuse these tools and share what I find. I have a brand new headline that I can be proud of. And with that, let's move on to the next point, which is writing your profile summary using ChatGPT. And if you're not already aware, the summary is extremely important. Even LinkedIn points out that members who include a summary receive up to 3.9 times as many profile views. So this is not optional at all. And for this, I'm going to propose two approaches. One of them would be using your resume to craft it so you can totally go ahead and say, write a LinkedIn summary section using my resume. Use keywords, then you enter your keywords, AI, generative AI, and media production. And then I would simply copy paste the text of my resume. So you'll find that prompt in the description below, but today I'll go with a different approach because I gotta admit, I don't really have a resume that is up to date right now, as that is generally not needed if you're doing YouTube. Instead, I'm gonna go with this one, which allows you to input your custom information. Use the following information to write a LinkedIn summary section, include an emotionally engaging opening statement, write in a conversational but professional style. Limit your responses to 300 words. Here is my information. I'm going to be pretty brief here. And it should also be noted that this doesn't have to be perfect. It doesn't have to be a perfect essay. That's why you have GPT-4. I just included three facts that I would like to have in there and I'll hit generate. It all began with a simple camcorder and a 12 year old's fascination with storytelling. Fast forward, okay, not eight years, but 17 years. And here I am, an established AI YouTuber sitting at the intriguing intersection of video production and artificial intelligence, relentlessly helping the world grasp the endless possibilities of AI. Honestly, that is pretty good. Now, as per usual, I would only use 
use this as a starting point and customize this to my very own needs. But there you go. You have a quality draft of something that you can now be proud of. Actually, in my case, I have a bio that I'm kind of happy with already. I'll just add this one paragraph, which I find super appropriate. My goal to make AI more than just a buzzword. And after some slight tweaks, I have a bio that I can be proud of, which concludes the profile setup section of this video. Because next up, we're going to talk about generating articles using ChatGPT. And this one can have a huge impact on your career. Because even if you don't have reach on LinkedIn, it just has to reach some of the right people that are interested in that topic for them to give you an opportunity to collaborate. And before we go into the article generation prompts that I prepared for today, I'm excited to tell you about today's sponsor, which couldn't be any more on topic. Today, I'm thrilled to introduce you to a tool that's going to supercharge your LinkedIn game. It's called Taplio. Taplio is an all-in-one tool that's trusted by over 1,500 customers to grow their personal brand on LinkedIn. It's designed to make your LinkedIn experience seamless and efficient. Taplio is packed with the features that are designed to save you time and energy. One of my favorites is the ability to search for high-performing posts in your niche. This feature gives you a wealth of inspiration and helps you understand what works for your audience. Another standout feature is the picked for you LinkedIn posts. Every day, Taplio curates a selection of posts tailored to your interests and industry. It's like having a personal LinkedIn content assistant. And speaking of assistants, Taplio uses the power of AI to generate posts for you. It's like having a professional copywriter at your disposal 24-7. But what if you find a viral LinkedIn post that you really love? Taplio has got you covered. It allows you to rewrite viral LinkedIn posts, giving you the chance to ride the wave of trending topics. And if you're struggling with your writing, which might happen, right? Taplio's AI writing coach is there to help. It's like having a personal assistant guiding you to create compelling LinkedIn content. And there's even a feature that auto DMs. So why not give Taplio a try? With its seven day free trial and 30 day money back guarantee, you've got nothing to lose. Just click the link in the description below to get started right away. Okay, so as mentioned, Taplio is a great way if you want to take your content creation for LinkedIn to the next level. But now there's also a basic yet powerful way inside of GPT-4 where you can take the current news articles and work them into a custom news article. So let me show you that to round out this video. So for step one, what you're going to want to do is go to settings and enable the beta features. And here you want browse with Bing and plugins. By the way, they just changed this to Bing. So now you have the Bing browser in here, which we're going to put to work now. You're going to post this prompt, which says provide article suggestions for my LinkedIn profile based on the industry. So I'm going to change this to artificial intelligence based on artificial intelligence news released on and then I'm going to do today's date. These suggestions should address current trends, challenges or best practices that professionals in the field would find valuable and engaging. All right, I'm going to run this and disclaimer right here, it might not work at the first try. Often the browsing feature bugs out and all you have to do there is either run it a second or third time or in some rare edge cases, just wait for five minutes and run it again. But actually with every new day, I found this to be more and more consistent. So just consider this is still in beta and it's not perfect. But as you can see here, it's already pulling in artificial intelligence news from today's date. And there you go. After a few failed clicks and retries, it actually got some of the information we wanted here and it starts writing the news article. Articles. And yep, when we click these articles, you will see that they actually come from today's date, May the 25th. Oh, and look at that. After generating three of them, it encountered some error. So now we're forced to regenerate. And this is what I was talking about. It's still beta. It's not perfect, but it works. So have a little bit of patience and consider that that patience will get you outcomes where a lot of people already give up and that will allow you to build your advantage. And there you go. The second attempt actually yielded an even more balanced result because it looked at more sites. And wow, if it works, this is so great because look, all of these are up to date. We got eight topics that would make for fantastic articles today. And all of them are up to date. Look, made. 25th. And this is really just step one. We're going to use a follow up prompt to build a small prompt sequence. And as you might know, this is something I teach in the course. And that's why we're also going to take a course prompt and put it to work here. So this is what that prompt looks like in its base form. OK, now we're going to customize it to write LinkedIn articles. So in its base form, it says write an article for a publication type addressing topic using writing style with a focus on specific angle and target audience. So a lot of variables to customize here. But for our use case, we're going to use a slightly adjusted version because this one starts with based on the above news stories. And what I did here is I really just added a building block in the beginning that references the context above. That's what's happening here. And now that it has the context above, plus we emphasize that it has to base the articles up on that. It's going to do even better because we're giving it strict instructions. And that's what ChatGPT wants. I want it. So we continue by saying write free articles for my LinkedIn 
LinkedIn, addressing today's news stories using a casual and conversational style with a focus on improved productivity and millennials in the US. Okay, here I'm making a lot of assumptions, right? This is my target audience. This is kind of the goal that I'm looking to achieve with the articles. But with this follow-up prompt placed after the research that ChatGPT did for us, it's going to consider all of that and write LinkedIn-style articles, which are based on news that came from today. So no more knowledge cut off in September 2021, right? And there you go. That's the first one. Hey, millennials, AI is shaking up the job market, but it's not all bad news. And it starts using this casual and conversational style, which looking at it with all the emojis, this might not fit LinkedIn. So here's my last tip. You can use this edit prompt command to switch it up and to get different results. Because now that you have the context above, although it might have took two or three tries, right? You have it. And now you can keep prompting things based upon today's news. So now I can just go ahead and change the writing style from casual and conversational to professional and friendly. And now I can say save and submit. And it's going to rerun this prompt with the new style, writing you articles that are perfectly suited for LinkedIn based on today's news, even using the references we have have seen above. And there you have it. We upgraded your profile and gave you options on how to create content for LinkedIn. Just consider that you could use all these tricks for so much more. You could draft connection requests, you could write messages. And beyond that, you could even write your cover letter and resume with ChatGPT. And if you want to take things even further, then this video will show you all kinds of ways that ChatGPT plugins can enhance your outputs. So make sure to check that out because also that comes with a free Notion resource. I'll see you there.